what we've tried to do as a company is create products that feel special. Our home means something from all over the world. It means something to our children, the art we put on the wall. It's not about what's trendy. It's really about how we like to live. Hi, I'm Jamie Young, founder of The Jamie Young Company. I started my business with my husband, David Jeter, about 25 and a half years ago. We really started this business to create beautiful products that we did not find out in the market. We couldn't find lamps out there that we love. We couldn't find shades we love. And we decided to start a business, travel the world and see what we could do. When we started the Jamie Young Company, we really thought about what do we want it to look like? What were the products? What do we care about? Everything we turned into these natural, organic, different textures from sculpture to different materials. I bring the word casual elegance into the conversation a lot. And I think that the product we produce says the same thing. We are based in California. I grew up here at the beach. David grew up from the mountains to Minnesota. So we bring a lot of different cultures into what we do, all based on a casual luxury feel. I had this crazy idea. I was gonna drive down to Mexico and find some cool stuff on the street to sell. It was really that simple. As things kept going, I knew I needed help. That's how I kind of got my husband to start working with me. He was building fine furniture. He was a painter and a sculptor. I just begged him, please start working with me instead. We can make this thing incredible and have this great integration of life work. 25 years later, we are incredible partners. We get to travel the world together. We figured out how to work together as husband and wife, raise our kids, and have some fun. It's funny because a lot of people are like, you work with your wife, and I'm like, yeah, it's, it's the greatest thing. And they think you must be insane. It's easier, I think, for us because we share a lot of the same taste levels. She'll be maybe more worried about the end consumer, whereas I may take a crazier, wacky tack that's like, no one's gonna put that in their house. <laughs> it's been fun to have our lives so integrated, and I think we're really lucky. One day David said, let's go to India. We should be producing product in India. And it, was, it felt so far away. Getting on a plane and just going and exploring and seeing what happens was, was the most exciting thing there was. When we first got to India, there were still cows in the airport. There's camels walking down the street and men in colorful turbans with earrings and giant mustaches. And, and you feel like you're walking into Casablanca. It's so beautiful, the color palettes and the blue city and the textiles. Like I personally am all about the fabrics of India and the colors in the farmer's markets. Everything about it, it gets into your DNA. Going to the Taj Mahal. That, it's not overhyped, it's a real deal. <laughs> I mean, just the vibrancy and the connection that the artisans have there with the materials they're working with. You're going down the road and you'll see giant pieces of fabric hanging out to dry that have been hand block printed. It just makes you want to do stuff with what they have at hand. It's, it's always inspiring. We went to meet local artisans. So whether we were in India or China or Vietnam, what did they do special for that country and that region? And that really inspired how we developed product, whether it was mouth blown glass, wovens, ceramics, metals. It really inspired how we would develop product based on who we were buying from and then taking our spin to bring it to the US. We've been working with some of these companies for over 20 years. They're small, family-run businesses that are incredible artisans doing very specific work for us in different regions around the world. We try to find factories that care about their employees. We do a lot of research and kind of auditing of the factories to make sure that everything is to code, that their people are taken care of. Jamie Young Company cares so much about what we're producing and the people we work with. 
I really believe that we started in lighting because it adds this incredible warmth to a room. Even in my own home, we turn off the overhead lights and we put on a table lamp. It creates an ambiance that's so important in, in kind of peaceful joy in our life. We've got wall sconces that are beautiful for hallways, their bathrooms. We have overhead lighting, hanging pendants over kitchenettes. Table lamps inspired our entire business. After 25 years, it is the largest collection that we have in the Jamie Ann Company. You can use them in every room in the house, from accent table lamps to large oversized table lamps to console table lamps into floor lamps. We really believe that table lamps and floor lamps create this special jewelry in a space. When someone's looking through the Jamie Young catalog of product, the thing I think that will stand out the most is the diversity of materials that we use. It has been one of the driving factors for design is what different materials we can apply from alabaster to agate, hides, leathers, metals, ceramics. It's not one note, it's not just one look. Everybody's home is different. And if you're a great interior designer, you're gonna find what speaks to your customer. And our pieces have enough diversity that will speak to a lot of different customers. It's amazing to be able to create beautiful product to put into people's homes. As long as we're creating product, we're touching our customers, it is what drives me every day.